video we'll be looking how the Cyanogen Mod 11 looks on the Samsung Galaxy S Plus. So let's get started. So starting with the UI, it is quite different from the stock Android and looks pretty decent. The status bar as well is quite different. Click on settings. There are various toggles like brightness and uh, other ones like Wi-Fi. This yeah, if we drag down from the right side, I mean the right edge of the status bar, we'll get these settings. As you can see, we get all these settings here. And we'll also have other great features of Samsung Mod. You can also download themes and choose themes from themes menu here. And you can see, choose from theme packs, styles, icons, etc the stable Sanogen mod features first let's go to about phone and here we have a look standard 4.4.4 click at and ok let's have a look at other things what other features do we have We also have ways to customize the lock screen as well as the notification drawer also. You can change the quick settings panel, enable or disable uh, the heads up notifications. So here is the quick settings panel. There are various things like this. And here is another interesting menu. That's the buttons. From here you can choose which button do, will do what. And it is a really good feature. You can choose various things like long pressing the volume buttons or making the menu button the recent button or anything this is really a great feature so that's it for this video if you liked it click on the like button and also subscribe to my channel thank you and have a nice day